In the mansion, the girls are getting ready to meet the bachelor for the first time. So exciting. <laughs> wow. I want them to know who's king. You look very fucking stunning tonight. Thank you. Bow, please. I didn't know that Australia had a king. Turn around, baby. Yeah, that's real nice. But you know what? There's something about a girl that you just, I don't know. It's just like, you just want to. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, get the fuck out of here. I've had enough. Hey, hey, stop. Go get the other girl. Fucking hell. They all look Aussie. You've had enough time with him. It's so unfair. Like, I just want to be jealous. What's going on? Mm. Have you got that um, surgeon's number? Yeah, yeah, don't worry about that. Leave oh, that tonight. On a big hook nose on her. Do you want a massive one? You get her a nice tan, black hair, no defects. Yeah, Once yeah. there's a defect, <clears throat> you're gonna be in for a lot of money, you know? Yeah. You got thighs, you got ass, you got all that. You don't want to get into that. Now it's time for the bachelor's first one on one date. I'm so excited about this date. Like, I can't believe that he actually picked me. Beep, beep! Next stop, heaven! Get in, baby! Yeah! Yeah, I'm on, a, I'm on one of those bullshit dates, bro. Yeah, we're filming now! I'm sitting there, she's not pedaling as much as I am. Poor! Keep pedaling, keep pedaling. Yeah, I'm pedaling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm on the date now. Yeah, she's fucking hot, bro. <laughs> bro, this is mad. Yo, I had a look at the contract. Apparently, I can get him pregnant, and the network has got to pay for him. You know, you're the first guy where I feel like I just don't have to censor anything that I say. So well, I think that's part of the problem. Because I've been sitting here and you've been talking shit the whole time. I think he's a little slow, but you know, I think that's kind of cute. Baby girl, I want you to open up to me. Well, when I first met you, I just thought, oh my god. What the I fuck? Can't... I mean your legs, not your mouth. Fucking hell, bro. I almost cracked the fat. After a wonderful day, it's time for the bachelor to meet Jessica's parents. Hi. Hi, Dad. Hey, how Jessica. Are how are you? Yeah. It's good. Hi. Hi, Dad. It's really lovely to have you. What are you doing? Go get us a couple of drinks. Let the men talk. Get out of here. I want to fucking break that prick's jaw. You are aware that uh, my lovely daughter wants to study at Harvard one day. The only thing she's going to study is a cookbook. Okay. My daughter hopes to do her PhD. Yeah, I've got a PhD. Pretty huge dick. <laughs> what do you reckon? Fucking same shit anyway. They go to uni and they slut around for five years. What for? I'll save your daughter the hassle of five years. I'll just give her one pretty huge dick. He is a fucking shit cunt. I'll be, I'll be here for 10 minutes and I'm fucking starving. What, do I let a bed use for food? What is this world vision? The parents look like a couple of sultanas. But how did you use to produce that? I've got no idea. I've had enough of this, mate. Get the fuck out of my house. No deal, bro. Back to the bachelor mansion, where the cocktail party is in full swing. He's already had a date with her. It was enough time. It's just not fair. Yeah, I'm gonna cut in. Can I steal you away? Excuse me, this is my date. Hey, 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 date. hey, if you're gonna fight, get physical. <laughs> Who will be going home without a rose? Amanda. Jessica. <laughs> Elizabeth. Smile. Listen, I know you're upset, alright? Get with my mate Johnny, he can show you something else that's long and has a red tip. 